CTV News, Canada's number one newscast. And buried alive. Hello? Hello? Did a master escape artist pull off a masterful Halloween stunt? <laughs> CTV National News with Sandy Ronaldo. Now from treats to tricks, and they don't get much trickier than this. Dean Gunnerson is a Winnipeg magician who pulled the ultimate disappearing act on Friday. He literally went underground, buried alive in a tribute to his hero, Harry Houdini, who died on Halloween. So did Gunnerson escape his early grave? CTV's Joe Makishan has the details. It had all the makings of a horror movie. You can do it, Dean. Come on now. Including the suspense. I give him credit. I would never do this. About 100 people on hand to see if the man who calls himself the world's greatest escape artist could escape this. Sweet dreams. On Friday, Winnipeg magician Dean Gunnerson was chained inside a steel coffin, lowered into a grave. So I hope to see you all guys Sunday. Yeah. Happy Halloween. And buried under three tons of dirt. This, the latest Halloween stunt by a man who's cheated death in the name of magic before. For nearly 30 years, Gunnarsson has been wowing crowds. He's escaped from a glass box filled with cement from inside a barrel underwater. But one stunt nearly cost Gunnarsson his life. In 1983, he was chained inside a coffin and lowered into the Red River. After four panicked minutes, rescue crews had to pull him out. Gunnarsson was unresponsive. He believes he died and came back. He said he'd never get in a coffin again, but here he is 27 years later. Gunnarsson calls this his most challenging escape ever, a stunt even his hero Harry Houdini tried only once before unsuccessfully. For two days, Gunnarsson has been living in his coffin, speaking to fans through a pipe underground. Hello? Hello? Waiting for 126 Halloween afternoon to emerge, the exact moment of Harry Houdini's death. Oh, I see your head! I don't know, that weight was just crushing on my, uh, my chest. Nothing is impossible if you truly believe, baby. After days without food and water, Gunnarsson says he plans to have a good meal, soak in a tub, sleep in a nice warm bed, and start planning how to top this stunt next year. Jill Makishan, CTV News, Winnipeg.